Hey, Toby here from tobychristensen.com. Thanks for checking out my coaching tip of the day. Uh, today I want to ask you, how do you spend your downtime? Well, one of the things that I've noticed over the last couple of years as I've started my coaching program and my MOVE program uh, is that there's, a, there's a sales cycles. People that I work with, regardless of the industry, seem to have times when things are really busy and times when things kind of, you know, slack off. And, of course, what we try and do is, through the, through the process of MOVE, we try and anticipate those cycles so that we eradicate them as much as possible, keep the cash flow rolling. But the other thing that's really important is how do you use your downtime? One of my clients uh, went into a bit of a tailspin <laughs> and uh, was rolling along, money's rolling in, sales rolling in, people calling all the time, you know, and he's filling orders and doing his deal, and bam, somebody turned off the switch. I said, so what do you do? And the answer was really quite shocking, actually. He watches TV all day, and he's massively depressed and can't get off the couch. <laughs> That's not very helpful. I get it. It's, it sucks when your business goes down the tubes. It sucks when sales stop or slow down. Got it. But what I worked with him on was how can we take this downtime and make it productive? Okay, one of the things that he and I had been talking about forever was for him to do some sales videos to help train his crew so that they had some videos so that he didn't have to spend so much personal time. He could send people, and as they hired people, it was a, it was a, a network marketing program that he was involved in. And so his downline was hiring other people and so on and so forth. So... I whipped his ass off the couch and we came down to the studio and we started making videos so that he could post them and his people had access when they had downtime to continue to stay motivated and uplifted and, and proactive and positive towards work. It made all the difference in the world. And the thing that was really interesting about it is that it shortened <laughs> the lull in the sales cycle. As he became more enthusiastic, those of you who work with me, you know I'm a big one on energy. Energy attracts like energy. When you're down in the dumps and you come to a screeching halt, so does everybody that works with you. Okay? Energy attracts like energy. If you can stay motivated and find ways, which of course is what we do in the MOVE program, motivation, organization, visualization, and execution, okay? So, and of course, this guy was in my MOVE program. So we go back to the motivation. Okay, let's look at, let's redo the worksheets. Let's rework the material. When he got re-motivated and we came in here and we shot videos, all of a sudden his phone started ringing again. It was great. Point is, utilize your downtime for something positive. Utilize the time when you're not out selling or, or answering phone calls and writing orders to create the platform for the next wave. Stay positive, stay motivated, stay focused. If you need help, get in touch with me. Let's have a conversation, see how I can help you. That's your coaching tip for the day. You have fun. I wish you much success.